Hi, I'm Liana Allison at the Institute of Empathic Leadership and today I want to talk about are you a accommodator? So are you too nice for your own good? Now this pattern of accommodating and I know it very well, I've been the best accommodator in the world in my relationships, it's all about control. So you know ultra nice and all the rest of it and sort of um, wanting people to have their best lives and to help them to do that. It's all about controlling a situation. So you're looking for companionship, but you're not actually being yourself. And then when you decide you want to be yourself, it all goes wrong because then you've got something to fight up against and you um, turn it into turmoil. So you start off in a relationship one way as the accommodator, which isn't really you. You want to then become you and all hell breaks loose because you've suddenly turned into a different person. So you must start from the start being really who you are. Now, if you're already in a relationship and you're accommodator, then it's time to talk about it, not just suddenly change, but actually talk about what's going on for you. Now you have to be able to figure out um, how to be yourself and to have your own opinions. So a lot of accommodators will automatically agree with people around them. Um, empaths do this a lot. It's supposed to make us feel safe. Um, in actual fact, we don't feel safe, but we think we will. So we just um, agree with everybody. So starting point, Figure out what your own opinions are, what's true for you and what's not. Um, the other thing is to basically butt out of everyone else's business. Um, their energy, what they're doing, what's going on for them. Just stay right out of it and concentrate 100% on your own energy, thoughts, emotions and patterns. This is where you will be able to figure out who you are. You will then know who you are so that you can pre present that in a relationship. You can still be able to help people and support people, but you'll know whether you're sacrificing yourself to do that or not because the accommodator will get angry eventually because resentment comes in, even though you've done it to yourself, resentment will come in and you'll project that onto your partner. So learn to know what it is that you, what it is that you really are, what your opinions are, what your values are, and live your life by those very deep core things so that you can stop accommodating for everyone else and start being true to yourself.